This is a typical debt portfolio. It looks like a labyrinth of debt. It is full of many different types of indebted accounts and assets. They come from many different product types, they find themselves at different delinquent stages, and they are desperate to get sorted out. Good portfolio segmentation is about finding the best way to get accounts out of the maze. Typically, a debt portfolio is segmented by product and delinquent area. But that doesn't show you how to sort it out. It does not optimize recoveries and drive up value. For that, you need more dimensions. You need something like Qualca Collections Portfolio Segmentation. An engine that lets business users define portfolio segments according to their desired business model. Quickly apply any changes or corrective actions without IT intervention. The Portfolio Segmentation Engine lets you set your own segmentation policy in ways that sharpen targeting, optimize recoveries, and allow efficient tracking and monitoring. Welcome to Qualco Collections. A sophisticated, user-friendly, state-of-the-art tool to manage debt portfolios in all stages of the debt life cycle. This is our main menu. It allows easy navigation to each discrete module. The Portfolio Segmentation module is the key core module for users to define and formulate operational segments. Let's see how segmentation is performed. This is the first screen. It's the Segmentation Overview screen that shows how cases have been allocated to the 20 most significant segments in terms of number of accounts and total debt value. Each segment is represented with a rectangle. We call the segments queues. The overview is interactive. Place the mouse over a queue to review its specific details. This overview can help you easily identify unusual distribution trends and prompt you to check further. You can change the view by selecting the Total Cases or Total Debt view. Let's click on Total Debt. The picture now is formed by value of each segment. Two types of queues are supported. Criteria queues, based on a variety of portfolio characteristics, and manual queues, based on manual selection of cases or file upload to handle exceptions. Let's navigate to the queue management screen. Click on the details option and you're there. In the criteria queues setup screen, you can manage existing segments and create new ones. The existing queues are presented in a list. The content of each queue is defined by the combination of a list of criteria selected from the criteria library. Queue creation and modification is very easy. Let's create a new queue by selecting the Add button on the main ribbon. The queue content is defined by selecting and combining criteria from the criteria library. Cases are routed to the queue when they meet all of its criteria. Any customer or case attribute can be used as a criterion in the decision-making and segmentation policy. And the criteria library contains more than 400 criteria. Search for the proper criterion from the criteria library with the quick search functionality. Just type part of its name and all relevant criteria are shown in the list. You can define the desired value of each criterion by writing the value or selecting it from the available ones. Amount, date, text and list of value criteria are available. Let's create a queue of product, for example, credit cards. In early delinquency stage, Let's exclude very low values like debt amount less than 5 euros. Let's add scoring characterization. Say we want to gather only high-risk customers. Finally, let's name our queue. You can also define the ordering of accounts within a queue with your own selected criteria. You can define ordering based on highest to lowest behavioral scoring, highest to lowest balance outstanding, last contact type with client, and many more. For instance, let's order the cases in the specific queue from highest to lowest debt amount. And this is the Qualco Collections Portfolio Segmentation Module.